welcome back. So I just want to say thank you very much for tuning in. Um, I just want to let you know what's going on for today. Uh, tonight I got a ladies night that I'm doing at the Irish Town Center. I'll be doing some hair, um, offering the ladies uh, a hairstyle, pampering them, making them feel much better. So, you know, I've got a lot going on today. Um, like I said in this video, it actually it's going to be a giveaway video, so I'm pretty excited for that. Um, the, what, the product that I'll be giving away is a rock product. It's called Retinox Correction. It's a smoothing anti-wrinkle moisturizer. Um, I figured that I do a giveaway just to you know touch base with you guys, let you know that I do have some products. Um, I went to a rock convention, and this is an amazing product. Unfortunately, it's for women ages 40 and over, and Whereas I'm only 25, I definitely don't want to use this because it's too potent for my skin. But it'll make an amazing product for like your mom, your grandma, somebody who, you know, really likes to take care of their skin and wants to try something new. So yeah, what I'll do is uh, you just share, like my video, the, and uh, the more shares that you do, the chance, the greater your chances are to get your name put in. Um, I'll be doing a draw at the end of March, maybe the beginning of April, depending on what time we have. Um, I'll do a live draw and I'll let you know who it is and whoever wins I will mail this to you so again it's rock retinox correction now that's backwards for you guys to see unfortunately but it is what it is so yeah thank you so much for tuning in um, I just thought I'd do something a little bit different with this video I have a lot of you guys requesting tutorials for hair makeup all that good stuff I promise I will be getting to it uh, what's going on right now is that with the way um, the Sun is actually there is no Sun it's just been snowing for three days I've got snow three quarters of the way up my window, so I don't have the best lighting. It's actually making me look really white right now, um, just because whatever is out there glaring, it's just it's making me look pasty. Uh, but I swear I have a tan on. So yeah, I'll be getting to all of your videos. Um, my first one will be how to do a smoky eye. That seems to be the biggest request. Um, and I love doing a smoky eye, so yeah. Keep your requests coming. I'll be working on videos. So this video actually is going to be a little bit different. I figured I would do one called What's in My Bag. Yay! Um, basically, I'm going to go through and show you guys what I carry in my everyday bag with for makeup. Um, it is a little bit of a big bag. It's a Neostrata one. I absolutely love it. Neostrata. Okay. Again, backwards. Sorry about that. So yeah, I'll just go through let you know why I have it and hopefully you enjoy. So this for starters. Um, I got my MAC Prep and Prime. Um, this is just a skin-based primer. It works amazing because it holds the makeup on really well. Also has a little bit of a shimmer, which I really do love. Again, that's Max Prep and Prime. Um, yeah, I just love this product. It is a little bit pricey. You can find it at your Mac local Mac store. We have one here in the Champlain Mall. That's where I got mine. Um, but it's worth it. I've had it since I think May last year, and I use it every day, if not every second day. You know. And it's been working. It's been it's lasted. I still have a lot left. Um, I am gonna have to pick some up soon. So yeah, there's that. Next, I got my CoverGirl Olay coverage. So this is actually a color and a correction. Um, I really like this product. I don't so much care for the Olay side of things. I do like CoverGirl though. Uh, this just has a lot of moisturizer in it, and I find that it doesn't make me like I have oily skin, and it doesn't make me look oily. So I really love that. Um, and it gives a great full coverage throughout the day. Next, I have let's see. Oh, my CoverGirl powder. Actually, um, it's just CoverGirl Clean. It's number one twenty in Creamy Natural. Um, it's just a regular powder. You know, just set your makeup on when you're done. After I use a little brush, I always set mine with a brush. And it's got a little compact mirror, so whenever you get to check yourself out, you know that's there. It's kind of killing two birds with one stone. Yeah, so next I've got mascara, just, you know, volume lash blast. Um, I just like this one. It kind of really fills my eyelashes out when I don't want super long, but I've got a nice um, subtle eye going on. I really like this mascara for that. Um, next, I've got uh, TG Lip Gloss. And this is in the color Foxy. TG Foxy. Again, backwards. Sorry about that. But I love this stuff. I swear by it. It is so amazing. Um, it's kind of, it goes on nice and thick, and it's not sticky like a lot of them are. Now, the clear glosses, I do find a little bit stickier, but the colored ones that they have, they have it this color, they have it in like a nude, a pink, um, kind of a, a lighter brown than this. This one's a little bit of a darker brown. 
Um, and then they have it in a clear and a sparkly clear. This clear and sparkly clear are a little bit thicker. I do like it when I'm doing a red lip and I want to have that candy apple look. I find it looks amazing. Um, but this I just put over like a lip liner or just a, whatever I'm wearing on my lips. I can just throw it on. It's really moisturizing and again, not sticky. So that's always a bonus. Next, I've got my TG Pen in Royalty. Um, so it's a purple color. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I've been wearing a lot of purple on my eyes, especially underneath, just putting it on and blending it out. Um, just something a little different, you know, everybody kind of goes to the blacks or the browns. I just thought I'd switch it up, and I love this, co this color. I also got a blue one, too, which I really, really love. Um, and I've got a red lip liner in Kiss from TG as well. I use this one a lot. Um, I like to create an ombre lip, which I will be doing a tutorial on. That is going to be, I think, my first one, how to do a red ombre tutorial or lip. Um, yeah, so I use either this. It's a really dark red. You guys can't really tell. Um, or a black, which I'll show you both. Uh, I just love it. It just works really well. It goes on nice. Um, and it's like one of my favorite colors to use with a red lip. Next, I've got an eyelash curler. For obvious reasons. Um, I don't generally take my mascara off or reapply it throughout the day, but I do have one set of eyelashes on this side that don't curl as much as the other one, so I just like to have this to give it a little bit of curl at the end of the day if I feel like one's falling or not. Next, I've got uh, lipsticks, actually. I have two lipsticks for now. Um, one in CoverGirl. Oh, you guys can't see that. Sorry. It's in the color Temptation. So it's kind of an orangey color. I love it. It goes on so smooth and it's so shimmery and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And I've got this one. It's by L'Oreal and it's in Orangza. Orangza. And it's a brown. Um, but I just love the way it looks. It goes on nice and natural. And again, I do a lot of natural looks based on my job because... I deal with a bit of an older clientele, and I really want them to see that I know how to apply my makeup, so when they're purchasing products for me, they know exactly what I'm talking about. But, you know, out to events, night out in town, I've always got the crazy makeup, so I'll be doing a tutorial on that too, so don't worry. Uh, next, I've got another mascara. Um, it's kind of running out now, but it's the Manga Mascara uh, by L'Oreal. Amazing. I love this mascara but only for certain times if I want that super um like when I'm doing just a regular eyeliner like a liquid eyeliner on my eyes this is one of the best mascaras I found to use to really make it pop um it kind of separates everything and a lot of the mascaras go by the brush this one kind Ooh. of has a soft brush so I like that um Next, I've got a TG concealer, which I lost the cap for. It's in a medium color, um, just because I got a lot of breakouts, you know, certain times during the month, you'll have a lot of breakouts. This really does cover it. I'm actually a bit on the darker side for skin, but you can't tell because of all this weather. I've got my Dove deodorant. We all know why we have deodorant. I've got a base nail coat, or a base uh, nail polish. I just carry that just, to, just because um, it's really good if you're in pantyhose and you get a rip or... You know, you you want to hold something in, like you, your nail polish starting to chip a little bit, put a little bit on, and it just holds it back down for the rest of the day. Um, hair clip, a little jaw clip. Yay. I've got a third mascara. Actually, this one's called They're Real. Really popular brand at Sephora. Um, I actually prefer the smaller tubes to the bigger tubes. I find the bigger tubes dry out really fast. This one doesn't, so there's that. Next, I've got two types of blush, one in a warm, one called TG, or one by TG called Brilliance. Um, it's a nice, just a nice warm color. It can actually be worn warm or cool, depending on your look, so that's why I like it. And I've got L'Oreal's Visible Lift Blush. It's kind of on the creamier side. It's a pink lift. It's really cool tune, uh, tone. I absolutely love it, though, especially when I'm doing a cool look. Two more items. I swear we're almost done. Um, I've got my Maybelline Master Duo Eyeliner. Liquid Eyeliner. Now, actually, I didn't realize what I was buying when I picked it up. I thought it was just a regular eyeliner. But the brush is a little bit different. Now, I don't know if you guys can see. See, it's flat on one side and kind of bigger on the other. And it creates one of two looks, depending on what you're going for. So if you really want that... Uh, 
if you're really looking for a um, thick, thick, thick eyeliner look, this is really great for that. And then you can turn to the side and just make a thin line, filling in right in the inner corners. I absolutely love it. So, And the last item that I carry with me is my Mariah Carey perfume. It just smells amazing. I actually, I don't smell right now. And even though I am a little bit sick, I can still smell a little bit. So I never go to yours without perfume or body spray or whatever, you know, some type of um, something that smells really good. Just because throughout the day, you know, you sweat, you glisten, and you may feel less than attractive when that happens. So it's just good to have deodorant and spray, and you're good to go. All right. So that's called What's in My Bag. Um, this is actually just my makeup bag. I will be doing a whole purse one one day. Um, there's a lot of stuff in there, so it'll be really fun. Again, comment below. Let me know what you guys want to see. Don't forget, like, share, comment on my video. Um, I'll be doing a draw for a rock product. Well, that's everything for today. I hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day. and See you soon. Bye.